Now, now we get into it after we've released with our coverage. And I'll talk more about uh, protection here in a second when I, when I look at the game film. When we go down into our coverage down the field, we don't know. We've got, we've got lanes assigned to us. I'll show you here in a second. So we go right here. We've got lanes assigned to us. So right here, the first man out getting to the ball, he's going to be heavy, which means he's basically a ball player. All right, he's going to play. This is our right side of the punt team. All right, we're going to have three players on our left side, the guard, tackle, and slot, or wing on our left side. They're going to be the same on that side, heavy force and edge. Okay, so we've assigned them to lanes. We've assigned them how they're lining up to make this play. So we go back here based on when, how you get out. You never know based on how you get blocked who's getting out first. Okay, you just don't know. Sometimes some guys make a double team, some guys make a knock back. So we're going to tell our guys they're going to sort, okay? And whoever comes out first of the guard, tackle, and slot, whoever comes out first, he's going to be the heavy. Now, you see right here, okay, we're just going to do this circle drill, all right, and let these guys decide after they come out. So right here, 50 comes out. He's first man out. So he becomes heavy. He's pointing, telling the next man out, you're outside of me, you're force. You see 57, he's the force. He's pointing to 81, who now becomes the edge. Okay, that way, yes, they have assignments when they're in their guard, tackle, and slot position. But when they come out in different places, they, they become, it's who they become, who becomes heavy, who becomes force, who becomes the edge. Okay, now, we'd like the heavy to go make the play. We're going to talk about our lanes, and we want to talk about, and I'll, I'll show you here in a second, but we'll talk about being 15 yards away from that returner we want the heavy to be on the inside eye of that returner, okay? I'm sorry, to be five yards outside of that returner, okay? We want the force to be five yards outside of him. We want the edge to be five yards outside of him when they're 15 yards away. Now, this falls into the boundary, into the numbers, so we're going to tell him to tighten up on the 15-yard mark right here. Now, we'd like our force right here to be a little tighter that ball and try to force that ball back inside. OK, we're going to tell our edge player he's got to get to the outside and be the edge, be contained and keep that ball inside, not let it back outside. OK, 